I'm interested in questions like what is life and what is consciousness and it's still these questions I'm doing my own research now by doing my artwork. Marianne Engel has always been fascinated by the mysteries of life. This is why she studied biochemistry. But then she discovered photography and became an artist. She disappears into the woods at sunset for long exploratory walks. It's too bright still. When the light goes down, things appear. This is when she likes to photograph. Back at her studio, she applies glow-in-the-dark paint to the plant she's found. The effect is dramatic and similar to what one can sometimes see in nature with the naked eye. She's particularly drawn to luminescent objects. It's a mushroom growing on wood and it's bioluminescent. <laughs> it glows in the dark but it's not very bright so you have to stay in the dark for maybe 15 minutes till your eyes are adapted to the dark. Her choices are totally intuitive and subjective. Romantic, you could say. But the scientist in her is always peeking through. One, one installation I might do one day is kind of a laboratory of a strange scientist. You look at it and you don't really know what kind of science he's doing. <laughs> Whether she's getting closer to the mysteries of life as an artist rather than a scientist is hard to say. Pictures here are worth a thousand words. Maybe it's not something to put into words. Maybe it's more what you see in the pictures. So, yeah. <laughs> um, some level behind the surface of the things.